Hi everybody and welcome to this tutorial. In this video we are going to see how to send our PCB design files to manufacture on GLC PCB. So we will get really a high quality PCB and we will receive this PCB box in our house on our hands. So let's get started. So this is the PCB we are going to send to GLC PCB and as you can see the name of this board is RAS which means Robotic R Shield version 1. So this is a shield for an Arduino Uno and also Arduino Mega and it has many information and if we just look at the 2D view we have the component dimensions, the positions, we have text, seal screen, logo, tracks, path, etc. So we have to send all this information to GLC PCB. And for that, we need to generate Gerber files. So this Gerber file will contain all this information. So I already generate this Gerber file and we are ready to send to GLC PCB. So before we send, uh, let uh, me show you uh, how we will get this PCB after we manufacture. I just will hide all the 3D components. So this is the PCB that we are going to send to GLC PCB. It has just two layers and as I said, it's a shell for Arduino Uno and also Arduino Mega. Okay, so now we will send these Gerber files from this PCB and we will see how to send to GLC PCB. Okay, so we are on GLC PCB website and before we send our Gerber file, we need to log in. If we don't have an account, we need to create an account. This account, we will save our information and also we are going to see the process of our PCB order. So it's really so much important. And by the way, this account is totally free. Okay, after we create an account, I already log in. We have many ways to send our Gerber file. One of them is over here on calculate and the other one is over here on quit now. So both of them will really work perfectly. In this case, I will click on calculate. Okay, so now we have to upload our Gerber file. So just click. I already uh, prepare these Gerber files and we have to wait until it complete okay when it complete we are going to see the preview of our PCB actually is like we we see on the program we design and we have uh, two good um, options here that they auto detect the two layers and also the dimension over here we have a really nice option and i recommend to click in the gerber viewer just click and we will open a gerber viewer for checking that our pcb is live with design so as you can see here the holes are on white color and if we come back to the first page, we see the holes are black. So it's totally normal and actually is correct. Just it's about colors. Okay, after we see, after we check that the PCB is like we designed, we can close and we can open again anytime we need. Well, here we have uh, more options and for example, layer, dimension, etc. Beside any option, we have a question mark. This will open an extra information. So the first option is layer, and it are already auto detect two layers. 
The second one is dimension, and again it auto detects the dimension. So the first two options we can leave as the page auto detect. So after that we have PCB quantity. If we click here in the arrows, we can choose from 5 to 8,000. In this case, I will choose 5. You can choose what you need. After that, we have PCB thickness. And they already choose 1.6 because this is the standard value, 1.6. In this case, I will work with this value, but also we we have another values if we need. PCB color, we have green, red, yellow, blue, six colors. In this case, I will keep the blue like we designed. Survive finish, we have three options and the first one, the this one is the cheapest one. Also, we have the second one that is similar at the first and this one the INIG that is a survive finish with immersion gold of course it will increase the cost the first one is the cheapest one and the basic and the most common one okay also we have a um, copper way one is enough gold fingers here, uh, this option works with this one. So, if we want to use this one, first we have to click here. Otherwise, this will not work. Next one, material details. Just we use, just we have the standard one. Next, we have panel by GLC PCB. In this case, if we click yes, we will generate a matrix of our PCB and here we have an example. So they will really make an array in horizontal and vertical way. If you need like that, also we can choose this option. In this case, I will click no. And we have the next option that is different design. Also, this one works with panel by GLC PCB. So we have the example, just one design, two design, three designs. Okay, in this case, just one design. And here we have the extensive, but in this case, our PCB doesn't have any SMD component. So we will not use, but of course, in another video, we are going to check how it works. So here we are. After we check all the options, we have the church details. And totally, the total price is $11. Really so good for this PCB. Okay, so after we are, we are happy with what we choose, just let's click here on save to cart. So we already have an order, but we need to continue with checkout securely. Here we will uh, give more information about our name, who will receive the address, and also, uh, for example, country, district, etc. So. After we give this information about where they will send the PCB order, we have a grand total because we add the shipping price. It depends so much about the place we are living. Okay, so we have here the shipping method and we have the nice DHL Express. So I will choose this one because I already worked many times with this and they will give in the time they program. And the next one is payment method and we have 
credit card on, and also PayPal. You can choose the one you have. In this case, I have PayPal, so just I click. After we finish to choose all these options and also the way we will pay, just click here on pay. They will auto direct to PayPal and you will pay the price and they will start to manufacture our PCB. Okay, so and now we have to just wait the days they will um, manufacture our PCB and we will receive in our house on our hands. Okay, so after we finish our PCB order, we are able to see the process and also the information about our PCB order. So just we have to click in the account option and here we are able to see all the PCB order we did. So the PCB that we order is this one, RAS PCB. We have an order number, uh, the information that uh, we have, for example, tracking number. We have more details and also we have the process. So if we click on the process, we have the list of what they do until they package to deliver. Okay, so they already finished and we are ready to receive our PC order. So let's see. Okay, so ta we finally receive our PCB order in our house on our hand from design to real. Okay, so let's open the GLC PCB order and when we open we can see that we have a pencil actually uh, from GLC PCB factory and with some other information. Here inside we have the five PCB that we order. Uh, we see that it has a plastic protection and also the PCBs has an extra plastic protection. Okay, so uh, as you can see I already opened because I wanted to show in this video. So look these high quality PCBs really they are doing a great job and um, we can see it exactly like we send like with design it's really from design to real so let's see just um, also the bottom layer and we have our logo seal screen the color and now we are continuing with some other details okay so we have our pcbs and as you can see we have the top layer and the bottom layer so let's see that uh, here we have to check some details and uh, for example we can start from the logo and the logo has really high definition they trying to do exactly like we ask and also we have this uh, little representation of an arm by the way the name of this word is RAS which means robotic arm shield version 1 and we have many other details like the seal screen and the text that they have a really high definition we can read immediately and it's so clear and of course also we have the blue color as we ask all the blue color is constant in all the surface this also happened on the bottom layer and we can see that this have a ground plane that we design okay so we have many other details like the path we have a really a nice metallization that will help to solder easily our components on the pcb 
and also it will really offer a, a good communication about our components. Okay, and we can see that also we have the tracks, we have uh, the metallization and the communication about the bottom layer with the top layer. And this happened on the vias. We have our vias, for example, here in the bottom layer, we have this uh, via that we communicate the top with the bottom, for example, this one. So we have all these things like we design. Okay, so we are in the last part of the video. Thank you so much for watching this video and all the links will be in the description and I invite you to subscribe to this channel if you didn't do it yet and of course uh, leave the opinions and questions in the comment section. So that's all for now and see you in the next video.